What's up, Facebook? How are you Facebook people doing today? Are you guys doing good today? I'm sure you guys are doing great today. Anyways, I wanted to show you a little something, okay? Uh, not sure since it's a live video. You guys probably didn't. You guys probably didn't even read what I put in the live video. So you guys probably didn't even read this. Uh, I'm about to fly out. I'm about to get on a plane and go to the United States of America. I'm going back to my hometown. Thank you so much, sir. I'm going back to my hometown in a little bit. Going to get on a plane. I'm just showing you this. I'm just showing you this so you can read this. Okay. So I'm just showing you this so you can you can read this. What's up, Landon Scott? Hopefully you're coming to Dallas. I'll get to see you at Dallas. We can hang out at Dallas. You can buy a bunch of my stuff at Dallas, all right? So if you read this right here, I'm just going to first show you proof, all right? So it does say right there, um, so it says you can actually grow your friends list on autopilot while you work, while you sleep, while you eat, and even while you poop, and even while you're fucking, even while you're fucking streaming live on Facebook, all right? And yes, don't worry. I've proven the model over and over and over again that you can get those random strangers to buy your stuff if you do the right things. I've had random strangers on Facebook paying me over $50,000 a month for the last 14 months doing this same process. I give you free training on how to do this, and I give you the software to do it with. You can grab my free training at the link below, that link right there, and you can get the software right after that. So first, since there's a lot of fake-ass fucking people in the world, let me actually sh log into my Stripe account and just show you on my Stripe account that I'm not lying about that whole $50,000 a month thing from random strangers. Today I made like almost 7K. Yesterday I made like 8K. Um, these literally are all from people I never met before. They're just random. <laughs> they're just random strangers. And if you're one of these people that are buying my stuff, hopefully you're not getting offended that I'm calling you a random stranger. But I mean, I'm just being honest. You're a random fucking stranger. I never met you before. <laughs> you know, I just literally added you on Facebook with the software. And then afterwards, I do exactly what I teach you right here in my free training. It's called attraction-based marketing. I try to provide as much value as I can to get you to see that I'm a valuable person and I give you free valuable stuff so that you it triggers reciprocity. And then whenever I have offers, like the offer that I made right here today, uh, and I didn't even tell anybody what they were buying. I haven't even told anybody what they're buying yet. And I've got 58 people who actually want to buy this thing. And I'm literally telling you in here that I'm not going to give you any information about what you're buying. Okay. So if you want to be able to do that, then you have to do attraction based marketing and you have to provide value up front. You can see in the last seven days, see, I'll just hit the refresh because I know there's shady marketers out there. You know, I should say what I should say is there's a few non shady marketers out there. All right. There's very few non shady marketers out there. Other than that, marketers fucking suck. Uh, but anyways, you can see in the last seven days, I've done $28,000 worth of revenue. And if we just go back to the last four weeks, $76,000 worth of revenue. And again, that shit's just coming from random strangers on Facebook. All right. So how can you add these random strangers on Facebook? It's pretty simple. Let me show you. It's really, really simple. Let me sh show you. Um, you could go in here, but I don't really want to go in here because I don't, I don't particularly think that's a good place for me to try to get customers from. All right. So let me scroll down Facebook a little bit and see if we can find somebody, um, if we can find some place, my incredible dog, probably not a good place for me to get customers from. All right. Da, 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 da. Can't find anything just scrolling down Facebook. So let me just do a search real quick. Marketing ninjas. I got a lot of software that literally helps you autom automate your marketing. These fucking marketing ninjas. <laughs> These fucking marketing ninjas, they may like this software. All right. Uh, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to use this software right here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to look for people who are marketers. All right. I'm going to look for marketers, owners, founder, CEO, because those are the types of people that I know like to buy my stuff. All right. So those people like to buy my stuff. So I'm just going to target those fucking people up. See, this guy, John, he will buy my stuff. This dude's a random fucking stranger on Facebook, and I literally did this exact same process. Uh, actually, I did a very, very same process. I didn't target him from a group. I'm going to show you in a second how I targeted this guy right here. 
to get on my friends list, but he's a random fucking stranger. He will buy my stuff. Why? Because I do the right thing. I add them up, and then once I add them up, then I do exactly what I'm going to show, exactly what I teach you in my free training um, on essentially, I'm not logged in as a, yeah, I am logged in as a Kita. Don't worry about that. I'm going to be on Kita for right now. All right? So don't worry about that. I'm going to be on Kita. That's no big deal. Founder, CEO, marketer, affiliate, um, owner. All right. So all these people, these are the types of people that I'm actually going to look for in here. These are the types of people that I want to connect with. And I'm going to set this on 9 to 11 seconds. You guys should never set this on 9 to 11 seconds. I've got a training that shows you exactly how you should use this software like a pro instead of a noob. Like literally, I give you step by step exactly how you should use it. Like I built this software for myself, not for you guys. I built it for myself. And then, uh, and then afterwards, I, I let you people buy it, you know. Uh, after I prove it, make sure it works. So I'm going to show you how it works. I'm just going to hit run. And let's see. Oh, looky there. There's a fucking founder and CEO. Let's send him a friend request. All right. Why? Because he's my target audience. He's in this marketing ninjas group. He's probably into marketing. He's listed himself as a founder and CEO. All right. Send him a friend request. This is an owner and founder at Breeze Marketing. Fuck it. Let's send her a friend request. All right. Um, she's probably in my target market as well because she's an owner and founder at Breeze Marketing. So she, fuck it, let's send her a friend request. Let's find the next person. Oh, hey, look at there. There's an owner at self-fucking-employed in the Marketing Ninjas group going to see how to pay. He wants to buy real bad. This guy wants to buy real bad. All right, here's another founder and CEO. All right, here's another owner. So as you can see, I'm just sending friend requests. I'm going to stop because I'm done right now. I just want to show you a demo. Whenever you guys use this, you should set this, you know, three to five minutes, all right? Why this is here, why these are here, these are literally for my demos whenever I go in and demo people, and they're for my partners. I got a partner program on the software where I literally let you sell the software for whatever price you want. I sell it for $47 a month. Um, unless you get my secret offers, and my secret offers I sell a little bit less. You know, I've got an, an offer out there that literally I give you $500 a month with the software for $17 a month, and then I use the $17 a month to fucking build schools and fucking donate shit like clothes and food and ovens to orphanages here in India, all right? Uh, so, but anyways, these are just for demo purposes, so you shouldn't use these. You should really use this three minutes and above. I usually stick around five to ten minutes, but you can see exactly what happened, right? You know, let me show you again just one more time. I'm looking for founders, for CEOs, for marketers, for affiliates, and for owners because I know these people are the types of people that buy my stuff. I've already figured that out, all right? So let's just run this again. Oh, look, there's an owner right there, okay? So let's send him a fucking friend request. Fuck it. Let's, let's send him a friend request. And then once he accepts my friend request, if he does, maybe he does, there's an owner. Um, if he does, if he doesn't, that will go away automatically. You don't have to do that. And this is the reason you shouldn't do that so fast is because if you do it too fast, Facebook will be like, eh, don't do that. Um, are you sure you want to do that? So you just don't go so fast. You go a little bit slower and you're good. That's why I'm telling you not to go so fast. I'm literally just going so fast in this demo because I don't want to be on a live fucking video for, you know, 45 minutes just for you guys to see me, see me send two friend requests. This shit all runs in the background. It runs in the background. So you can continue to do like literally I go to sleep with this software running. I've used this software to, to add now over 30,000 friends. You know, I add a bunch of friends. I delete them. I add a bunch of friends. You guys, if you've been following me, you probably been my friend before. And then I probably fucking deleted you because I delete every single person on my friends list and I start over. And what I do when I start over, I go in and add my buyers like the people who have bought for me because those people usually engage in my stuff and they buy my stuff again. So I have a list of all my buyers. I go back in and I add all my buyers. And then after I add all my buyers, I try to target completely new people that I didn't target before so that I have a whole new audience and a whole new group of people that can either fucking hate me and go all over the internet and talk shit about me or they can buy my stuff. I don't really fucking care either way. So here's one place where you can go right here. All right, just like that in a group, all right? Groups are great places for you to just add friends on autopilot because they're already essentially they're already essentially raising their hand that they're a certain type of avatar. I sell shit to marketers, even though I'm not a marketer and I'm not a big fan of fucking marketers. I do fucking sell them stuff. All right. So these marketing ninjas are people who have raised their hands, expressing an interest in marketing. Um, so they're probably already they're par probably in my target 
avatar. They're probably in the type of target. And then I further just filter, you know, the group itself is just one way to get in and know, Hey, these, another thing that I do is I join paid groups all the time. Like I'm in so many groups that they charge money to be in those groups. I literally just fucking join those groups so that I can go in and add everybody in that group to my friends list, start my process of attraction marketing, get them to all buy my stuff. Some people don't even let me in their group. Like Blake Newbar, he fucking completely threw me out of his group. Not because I was doing anything bad, because I sent friend requests to people in his group. All right. That's why he kicked me out of his group because I was sending friend requests to people in his fucking group. Even though as soon as you got in the group, there was a big fucking notice as soon as you got in the group where it said you were encouraged to network and meet and mingle and to fucking pour each other. Anyways, so groups are one good place. You know, I go into the group because they're pre-qualified to some extent. They've already raised their hand. And then I further filter out the exact type of avatar that I'm looking for. All right. Another thing that you could do is let's say, let's look at all admins and moderators here. Blah, 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 blah. All. Let's say Kevin David. All right. Let's say Kevin David. I know Kevin David. I mean, I don't know him, but I know who he is. And I can assume... Uh, I can assume, oh, Kevin David, hmm, his friends list is, oh, no, it's not. All right, great. So I can assume, based on what I know about um, Kevin David, I can assume that he is also what he's doing, all right? He's attracting a certain type of avatar in the content that he puts out, all right? So let's look at his content and see what type of content he puts out. I already know what type of content he puts out. Um, he's the CEO of and founder at That Lifestyle Ninja LLC. He's followed by this many people right here. All right, so he's followed by all these people. He's followed by a whole lot of people. But I can see based on the content that he puts out, I can kind of assume and understand what avatar he's attracting. So who's on his friends list? Who's he adding as friends? Who's he's a, who is he accepting as friends? All right. I can get a good understanding of that based on the content that he's putting out. Then I can decide, is this a good person for me to target? Should I target him and his friends list? All right. Now, I do this often as well. I find influencers. You know, some people think it's dumb, but here's what I like to do. I'm not a marketing person. I'm not a salesperson, so I don't really like to do marketing. I don't really like to do sales. And what I really don't like is I don't like the cost to acquire a fucking customer. I hate the cost to acquire a customer. It fucking sucks to spend money to acquire a customer. The only good thing about spending money to acquire a customer is you spend some money, you acquire a customer. When you acquire them, they bought something. Um, it doesn't really matter if you made money off that sale or if you lost money off that sale. If you know their lifetime value, then you know that you're most likely, on average, going to make a profit in the long run because they're going to buy more stuff. That's the only good thing about the cost to acquire a customer, but it sucks because it costs you money. So what I like to do is I like to let other fucking people, specifically fucking marketers, I like them to pay the cost to acquire a customer for me. So I like them to go out and actually spend their time and their efforts and their monies qualifying customers and acquiring the customers. And then after they go in and fucking create a market and they go spend their time and effort and their money acquiring customers, I like to like a vulture or I like to think of myself as like a fucking eagle. I like to then swoop down and just do what they were trying to do better. That's what I like to do because then I don't have to pay the cost to acquire a customer. So how do I do that? This guy, this guy, wherever this guy is at, here's this guy. This guy is actually acquiring customers for me. He's going through the process to, to put out the content and attract the right type of avatar that's the same avatar that's going to buy my stuff. So um, I am going to come in here and do the same thing. And I'm just going to basically piggyback on that. I can put in keywords here if I want to as well, but I'm not going to. And I'm just going to hit run. And just like that, guess what? Friend Connector is going to do its thing some more. It's going to go in and it's just going to automatically add up these friends you see. It's sending this person a friend request and it'll come over here, send this person a friend request and then this person a friend request. And it will just do this on autopilot while I'm fucking sleeping. All right. I don't have to do anything. I come over here now. I do whatever I want in my affiliate platform. I can literally check in my business model how many customers I got yesterday. I got 49 new customers yesterday. I mean, somebody else brought them to me. Thanks a lot for that. Um, and that's all I'm going to do. See, 
as I'm gone, look, it's already sent all these friend requests for me. It's already sent three friend requests for me being here. It's already sent friend, three friend requests, just like that. Now, I don't have to do anything. I just sit here. I run this in the background. Again, what I do is I go between five to, to 10 minutes to 15 minutes. I go in the background. <coughs> it just kind of does its thing. All right. So it just really does its thing. And then I wake up. Guess what? I go to sleep. Maybe I go have sex with my wife or something. Maybe I go play with my monkeys. Maybe I just do some work. I'm always doing some type of work. Maybe I'm working on my chat bot. Maybe I'm building my chat bot. I'm working on getting, you know, I've, I've got a goal to get uh, 10,000 subscribers in my chat bot by the end of May. So I want to get 10,000 subscribers in my chat bot by the end of May. So maybe I'm working on my chat bot. I'm doing something, all right? Something I'm doing. I'm doing something. And while I'm doing whatever the fuck that something is, uh, then then friend connectors doing its job in the background all right landon i will say your name fucking properly you don't have to become a partner you just literally have to message me like a voice message and just fucking tell me um how i say your name properly because it i'm fucking just saying it how i'm reading it so either fucking spell it properly or you just fucking send me a message and you just like literally audibly tell me audibly tell me fucking how to say your name all right and then and then, yeah, I'll fucking say it properly. So I do them both, by the way. So I do chat fuel. Um, some shit I do in chat fuel. Some shit I do in mini chat. The only reason I'm doing this shit in mini chat is because I'm doing, I'm revamping my training in mini chat because a lot of people have asked me to, to redo my training and update my training. So I'm redoing my training. I personally prefer chat fuel because chat chat fuel gives you access to, to things that mini chat doesn't give you. And if you're a fucking pimp like me, then you can do cool stuff like this is the main reason look i'll show you exactly why i use mini chat or why i use chat fuel this is exactly why i use chat fuel um hey wait mm -hmm. right there see that right there that's literally the the that is literally um linden all right so i'm just saying it as it's uh, I'm just saying it as I see it. All right, Lyndon. Like I said, you could just literally like voice message me that. This is why I like chat fuel and this is why I prefer chat fuel. All right. Because they give me access to this right here. And I use it all over the place. Like if you look at my welcome message, if you look at my welcome message, and I'm going to go back and show you this other thing in just a second. If you look at my welcome message, as soon as somebody comes into my chat bot, look, I'm basically decoding that reference parameter. All right. And based on that reference parameter, I'm sending them someplace. Like if you look inside my affiliate platform, I have an affiliate link to my chat bot. I could never build this in mini chat. I could never fucking build this in mini chat. So literally inside my chat bot for everybody that gets in my chat bot, they can literally uh, like my partners and stuff. They can literally just dump people in my chat bot and my chat bot will sell them things and give my partners their the credit for not doing anything but sending people to my chat bot. And the way it allows me to do that is I use this ref parameter, all right? In this ref parameter, I make a custom affiliate ID for all of my, this is literally my chatbot user ID. And anybody who gets in my chatbot, they have their own unique ID. And I just create a unique affiliate ID. And then in my chatbot, I just literally look and I say, hey, look, uh, did that person just come into my chatbot with a, a ref that starts with AFF underscore? Um, if so, then I basically need to send them to somewhere. Like I need to send them over here. Look, they started with this. So I need to send them over here to this referred by affiliate thing. And then over here, literally, I grab that ref parameter. I send it out to Zapier. I do some magic stuff. And now all of a sudden my chat bot, my, my chat bot literally now all of a sudden, if you look, my chat bot literally knows, look, I'll show you. Um, my chat bot literally knows all the people in my chat bot. It, it knows who who sent that person to my chat bot. As you can see, I can see that this person right here sent this person right here. You know, I can see this person right here put this person in my chat bot. So literally I can go in and I can see these people that are coming into my chat bot, where are they coming from? And I can run contests and I can actually incentivize people to drive traffic to my chat bot and build my chat bot list for me. I'd give them some money or something. I'd just be like, hey, here's a prize. I'm gonna give $100 to whoever puts the most people in my chat bot. And I'll get a lot more. I'll get a lot more leads in my chat bot 
from that hundred dollar prize than I would if I spent a hundred dollars on Facebook and asked them to send people to my fucking chat box. So I use them both. I use mini chat and chat fuel. So back to this shit. The other thing that I can do is Facebook, you know, Facebook's like, yo, hey, what about all these people? It recommends people based on the people I'm already connecting with. So I can come over here. You motherfucker, it's Lyndon, not Landon. Fuck you, motherfucker, it's Lyndon, not Landon. He <laughs> he he. All right, Lyndon. All right. So fuck you guys. You guys heard Lyndon. Fuck you, motherfucker, it's Lyndon, not Landon. He <laughs> he he. All right. Uh, <clears throat> so now I can come over here. I already showed you. You can literally go into a group, all right? You can go into a group. You can target an influencer if you want to target an influencer. Um, and then you can come right here to, to who Facebook recommends. And you have different options here, all right? Now, I've tried it both ways, and it really depends on what you're wanting to do. If you're wanting to diversify your audience, so basically you're just going to come here again, and then you're going to set based on your mutual friends, all right? So you can do it one of, one of two ways. You can say, hey, look, I only want to target people who have greater than, let's say, 100 mutual friends, all right? So um, if we don't have at least 100 mutual friends, you can't be my friend, and it's going to go add this person because we got 133 mutual friends, all right? So now we get, to, we get to fucking be friends and shit. Once we be friends, I'm going to do my process of attraction marketing, and then it's going to go to the next person. We have 167 mutual friends in common. It's going to add that person up. And now we're going to be friends and shit. All right. So then it's going to go to the next person and continue to do that. So that's one way. And this way you would do if you're trying to, let's say, let's say you don't have a lot of credibility online, right? Uh, so if you don't have a lot of credibility online and people don't know who you are or you don't have any place that you can send people to that shows, hey, motherfucker, this dude is smart. This dude's, you know, or this person has authority. This person has some credibility. They've got testimonials, all this good shit. If you don't have that, then what you want to do is you obviously want to connect with people that have a lot of mutual friends. Why do you want to do that? Well, the reason you want to do that is because whenever, guess what happens? Look, I, again, I'm going to go back to this post where I'm selling something on this post for $25. It's just $25, but I do have 61 people who said that they want to buy it. Let's say 50% of those people, let's say 50% of those people um, actually go in and buy it. So what is that? That's 30 times 25. That's an extra 750 bucks I can make just from this post. All right. But guess what? Some of these people in here, some of these people in here that are saying that they want to buy my stuff, I have mutual friends with those people. Let's say maybe, maybe I'm only adding people if we have at least 50 mutual friends. So now whenever this person says something, well, the 50 mutual friends that we have in common, they get to see my post. So they're going to see my post and they're going to see that one of their friends is committing to buy. So that gives me some credibility. That gives me some authority because their friends are commenting on my stuff. Monkey see, monkey do. They might go buy my stuff as well. All right. So that's one, one way you can do it. The other way you can do it is if you want to diversify your audience. All right. So if you want to have a real diverse audience and you don't want to just be you don't want to just have, you don't want to just have, um, you don't, So you don't just want to have a whole bunch of people who have a bunch of mutual friends. You really, really want to diversify your audience, right? You want to have like all sorts of new people who aren't actually connected to each other. Well, then you just switch this to less than or equal to. And let's just say, hey, I want to do this to less than or equal to five. All right. So let me just refresh this page because I already started here. And then we'll basically just go back again. And we'll just say, hey, I want to change this to less than or equal to five. So now we have to have you know, less than or equal to five mutual friends. And here's one. Here's a person. I only have one mutual friend with this person. We don't have a lot of friends in common. So I'm diversifying and diversifying and diversifying my audience. Why? Because the people that I have a whole bunch of mutual friends with, they're all probably the same type of people. You know, this guy is probably, you know, connected to the same type of person that this other guy is, right? Oh, this guy, I don't want to fucking be his friend. Sorry about that. I should have removed him first. I don't want to be that dude's friend. Um, uh, I don't want to be that guy's friend because 
because he had a funny fucking name. That's why. <laughs> if you want to be, if you just want to be totally honest, I didn't want to be his friend because he had his name was a fucking squiggly line. That's why I didn't want to be his fucking friend because his name was a fucking squiggly line. Not that I'm racist or anything like that. I just try to stay away from the squiggly line people myself because they usually like try to send me cock pictures and stuff like that. And um, I don't like cock pictures that much unless they're my own. So now I'm just connecting with these people that we have a very, very low amount of mutual friends and it just does this on autopilot. Again, I go off, I do whatever I want. This thing does its job in the background, all right? So that's kind of how this software works. That's how this software actually helps you just connect with people and connect with people and connect with people. Um, that's how it works. It works really, really great. It's the reason that, you know, I, I'm able to grow my, now I only have, I only have 1,107 fucking friends, but already I got a bunch of them to actually comment on my stuff, engagement on my stuff, buy my stuff. Um, and if you go back, you'll literally see, like, if you go back, you'll literally see the first post that I made on this Facebook account, because it's a brand new Facebook account that I started. All right. I mean, the reason that I do that is because I like to use my own software and I like to make sure that it actually works properly. Um, if people are going to buy it, because I really hate it whenever people ask me for a fucking refund um, or whenever people, you know, I, I really hate it whenever people complain about my software because those softwares are like my fucking babies, you know, and you guys probably wouldn't like it if somebody came up to you and said, hey, your baby's ugly or hey, your baby's fucking retarded. It would probably you would probably be offended about it. I just started this Facebook account February 8th. So this is the very first post that I ever posted on Facebook was February 8th. All right. So from that, that's like less than a month and less than a month I've already brought up to uh, 1,107 friends all right by just using this software a little bit at a time a little bit at a time connect with the right people connect with the right people connect with the right people and then again do what I teach you right here for free you know you can opt into this free training right here make sure you click that if you want to opt into this training I put the link above in the video um, and this literally, like I said, this literally is me showing you, you can watch this social proof where I literally show you, you know, the, the $1.8 million, almost $2 million that I've made right here from Facebook, from fucking strangers that I've fucking used the software to, to add up. It shows you literally the step-by-step -step process and exactly what I do after I add those friends, after I connect with those friends, you know, obviously just having a large amount of friends does not get you rich. Just having a lot of friends does not make you money, all right? But just doing the right things without an audience doesn't also make you money. You kind of have to have them both, all right? So you have to have them both. Just being a girl and having an egg doesn't make you a baby. Just being a, just being a, a boy and having a dick and sperm doesn't make you a fucking baby. Just being a man and woman together, married, holding hands, doesn't make a baby. You got to take the dick. You got to stick it in the pussy. It has to ejaculate. Then there's a chance that you can have a baby, all right? There's some pre-required stuff. So you've got to have friends. The more friends that you have, the bigger the audience that you have. But just having those friends isn't enough. You have to be doing the right stuff. And then if you do the right stuff, people will take you seriously and they'll buy your stuff, all right? If you do the wrong stuff, and I see the wrong stuff every day, and I point that out in my training, what is that wrong stuff that you shouldn't be doing is literally pointed out in my training as well, all right? If you want to sell stuff on Facebook, you can totally sell stuff on Facebook. I sell stuff every single day on Facebook. I showed you already my Stripe account once and kind of showed you some of the some of the money, you know, in the last four weeks, $76,000 that, that I made in the last three months. Um, I made over a quarter million dollars in the last three months right here on Facebook, all right? But you have to do the right stuff. I see some of you guys trying to sell stuff on Facebook, but that's all you do. Literally, that's all you do is try to sell stuff on Facebook, but you don't provide any actual value. All you try to do is be like, oh, hey, I have this offer. You get this, this, and this. You can buy it, but you don't actually ever provide any value, which is why people don't buy your stuff. I see some of you fucking joke-ass affiliates you guys don't even do anything but post an affiliate link. That's it. You won't even take the time. You won't even take the time to use a software like Link Wizard, um, which I also give you guys after my training. You won't even use a software like this to encapsulate your link to let the rest of the world not even know that it's an affiliate link. Literally, this is what a lot of you affiliate marketers do. That's it. That's it. You don't do anything more than this. And then that's why you don't make sales because this is literally all you do. You do nothing else 
but this right here. You have an affiliate link, somebody gives you an affiliate link, you just literally go post affiliate link <coughs> on your page and nothing else, all right? So you gotta do the right things. You do the right things, and if you do the right things, then you can make money. If you don't do the right things, then you can fucking look at cat pictures and shit like that on Facebook, all right? We do have a lot of cool stuff also coming into Friend Connector. Oh, look at that, this is Friend Connector right here. So uh, we got a lot of cool stuff also coming to Friend Connector, other ways for you to add friends. Pretty soon, I'm actually giving you guys a way to automatically connect with all of these people right here. So pretty soon, like literally pretty soon, um, we are gonna be launching a feature where all of these people that are commenting on a paid ad or commenting on, you know, leaving an emoji on not just paid ads, but any any post on Facebook where you can go in and you can connect with all of these people as well, all right? And these people are gonna be great because now what you can do is you can go stalk. You can just, the people, you know, your competitors or people who are selling complimentary pro products, people who are selling to the same audience as you, you can literally just go find them. You can find their good performing post and you can be like, look, everybody that liked this, I wanna send them a friend request and I'm gonna connect with them. Or everybody that commented on this, I wanna send them a friend request and I wanna connect with it. Not just paid ads, so it's not just paid ads. You can literally do it to any post on Facebook. So you can go to any post on Facebook and then if you're smart and you use post filter, Post filter will allow you to actually filter out and see only ads or remove all your ads and see only posts. And then it will allow you to essentially put keywords in what you wanna search for. So you can go in and you can just put in the keywords for what you're searching for. Then you'll find only those posts. Then you can open those posts up and you can connect with only the people that are on those posts. Like if I knew that these dudes right here, Go Tech Digi, whoever the fuck these guys were, if I understood, and I can understand real quick just by coming over here and I can look and see um, why am I seeing this ad and I can fucking figure out why am I seeing this. Uh, they're looking for founders, directors, and CEOs. They're trying to reach people between 18 and 50. They're trying to reach people that Facebook thinks are interested in Instagram and they're trying to reach people whose primary location is India, all right? So if these demographics, if these demographics match my target avatar, if they match the type of person that I'm wanting to sell shit to that I know is going to buy my stuff, well then guess what? I could target these guys and their three little likes that they got, I could go add these people up as a friend, all right? I could connect with these people. Or if I know somehow that this person or this person or any of these people are influencing the, the target avatar that's gonna buy my stuff, and I can see that they have a good amount of, I can see that they're talking about something similar, all right? Like I follow people who have similar softwares to me, all right? I follow, Brandon Clark wants to buy my stuff, awesome. I don't really know who fucking Brandon Clark is, but he wants to buy my stuff. Thanks a lot, Brandon. It's a random stranger on Facebook, wants to buy something, and I haven't even told people what it is that they're buying. I've just given them this picture. That's it. I've only given them this picture right here. That's it. That's all you get is this picture. And um, this is as much information as I'm willing to give you about what I'm selling, and still, people want to buy it. All right? So if these guys are talking, like, for example, I have this software, Chirply. It's really, really awesome. All right? I use it every day. You know, today, I have it literally. I got all these ads. Well, not all those ads, but... I got all these ads running in Facebook, all right? These are my leads that have just came in today on Facebook. All these leads have just came in today on Facebook, and I literally have Chirply connected right to, right to my ads so that as soon as a lead comes in, um, as soon as a lead comes in, literally, look, I send them out a text message, just like I did this person. I send them out a text message. I send out an automated phone call. We have an automated phone call, just kind of like, let me show you one that I had just a little bit ago. Um, let's see, let me show you one, like I had a little bit ago. None of these, maybe like this one. So it automates this entire process for me, all right? So this automates my entire process for me. It does the connection, we get connected. I do my, I do my sales, it sends out these things called sales bridges, all right? Um, or it will send out IVRs. I do my thing, I talk to them, that's what all these are, all right? 
Um, these are like literally the other things where you don't see an audio. It's literally because they didn't pick up and we didn't have a phone call. You know, they didn't pick up. So I didn't waste my time talking to them because they didn't pick up. This does ringless voicemail. It does two-way texting. It does IVRs. You can build your IVRs, which are like um, decision trees that help you pre-qualify things. All right. It's a really cool software. It's really bad, uh, really badass software. Like I said, I use it every single day um, as part of my process. Like if you go, somebody opt into the Link Wizard opt in form like this. If you go opt into my partnership funnel, as soon as you opt into my partnership funnel, he's lying, Sonia. He didn't guess shit. He's just lying. That's cool though. As soon as you opt into my partnership funnel, I send you out the sales process. It's me telling you you just opted into my into my partnership funnel you were just checking it out um and that's the reason i'm talk i'm calling you if you want to speak to me right now and get a good deal on the phone press one and if you press one we're instantly connected this guy has intent he's opted into my funnel once he's opted into my funnel he's listened to this audio then he pressed one because he wants to speak to me directly now we're connected I didn't waste my time whatsoever. Whatever I was doing, we were connected, all right? But this does ringless voicemail. It does two-way texting. It does all sorts of stuff. So on Facebook, I also follow other people that have similar types of software or promote similar types of software. And I can go in and I can see, oh, hey, they have a post where they're talking about ringless voicemail. Guess what? I'm going to go to that post and I'm going to target everybody who's liked it. I'm going to target everybody that's commented on it and I'm going to add them as a friend because I can tell that they're interested in the same type of thing that I sell and probably I can provide a better quality product and service because that's what I focus on. I don't focus on the marketing side of things. I just focus on making sure that the product is better than everybody else. I let those bastards fucking, I let them focus on the marketing and the customer acquisition. They can, they can focus on the marketing. They can focus on the customer acquisition. And I just already know they're not going to focus on their product because most people don't. Most people just want money for the sake of money. All right. So they're just out marketing. They're hyping everything up. They're focusing on their marketing instead of focusing on their product. And that's fine. I focus on my product. I let them focus on the marketing and I let them go find all the customers for me. I let them get everybody to raise their hand and bear the entire cost of acquisition for me. And then once they do all that, I just, like I said, I come in like an eagle. I connect with those people. I do attraction-based marketing and I offer them a silver product or service that just actually works better. All right. So that's how you can actually go in and that's how you can connect with people on autopilot. All right. This guy will buy. Great. Thanks for buying. That's how you can go in and actually connect with people on autopilot while you sleep. I showed you several different ways that you can do it and how it actually helps you see as we've been as we've been on this video these people that I that I showed you I was sending friend requests to they're accepting my friend request even while I'm live on this video they're accepting my friend request and guess what my friend list is growing and it's growing with exactly the type of people that I want like look Joel Kelman just came on my live video all right now I'm going to say it even though he's here and hopefully he's one of the cool ass marketers and not one of the scared ass marketers. And he is cool. I've been following him for a while. Now, Joe has a software called Online Sales Pro. All right. And he's got some other software that he's been that he's been developing that I've been checking out. And it's like some type of training portal and stuff like that. But Joel's a good example of one of the people that I follow that has not necessarily a competing software, but is selling to the same type of avatar that I sell to, all right? So I'm not gonna say that his software is a competing software to mine, but he sells to the same type of avatar that I sell to. So in my process, you know, I just let Joel do all the fucking marketing. He can do the marketing, he can do the fucking customer acquisition, right? So he can do that shit. He can focus his time on, you know, marketing, and fucking customer acquisition. And what am I gonna do? I'm gonna focus just on my product. And since I know that Joel is out there attracting the same type of people that I sell to, guess what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna attack his fucking friends list. I'm just gonna be like, okay, thanks a lot, Joel. Don't get mad, don't unfriend me, Joel. Um, and if you do, it's whatever. You wanna be the first marketer to unfriend me. But that's what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna go in and be like, all right, buddy, uh, go in. All right, so he's got lead out now. Nothing against lead out, but you know, Chirply is just a better version of lead out. Now there's a lot, there's a lot of differences. You know, Chirply is not meant for agencies. Lead house really meant for agencies. It's meant for agencies that are doing lead gen for 
for their clients. And I've checked out that software before. It's a good software. Uh, but we have an overlap in audience. We're selling to the same people. So I'm going to let Joe, I'm going to let him do all the customer acquisition. He can go do his personal branding, his marketing, and he can, he can spend his time and efforts and he can attract up the right type of people. Now that's great for him. So he's attracting those people. What am I going to do? I'm just going to go and I'm going to target his people because I know that they're the right type of people for me. So I'm just going to go in and be like, okay, well, these people that you've targeted and are on your friends list. All right. Uh, these are probably the right type of people. Look, the MLM people, they also like my partner program. The MLM people, they love my partner program, all right? So they really love my partner program, so I can just target his list, all right? I just literally go in and target his list. Hey. And that's part of my process. All right. I don't like to do the marketing stuff. The marketing stuff is just not my it's just not my cup of tea. All right. It's not really it's not really my cup of tea. So I don't really do it. I'm drinking my cup of tea right now as we speak. But this is one of the ways that I this is one of the ways that I go in and I grow my friends list every single day. Now, once I grow my friends list again, what I do, I just do attraction based marketing. I try to provide as much value as I can, try to connect with people on a personal level. I try to let them see like a little bit of snippets of my life. I leverage my monkeys, let them see my fucking monkeys and stuff. And then I just talk about the stuff that I have to offer. Well, more importantly, I talk about the problems that they have and how my shit solves their fucking problems and makes their fucking life better, okay? That's what I do. So hopefully you guys can see how this software works. Uh, if you wanna get your hands on it, you can go take my free training where it's all about attraction marketing and it literally teaches you exactly how to leverage your friends list and leverage social media and make a shit ton of money instead of just piss people off by, you know, telling them to like your page as soon as you add them on Facebook, all right? So this teaches you like literally the do's and don'ts, what you can do on Facebook, what you can't do on Facebook. And then right after you come in here, you just opt in just like that. Right after you come in here, I'm literally going to send you a text message. Uh, I'm gonna send you a text message and I am gonna make you an offer. Obviously, I'm gonna make you an offer. If you don't want my offer, just click this right here um, and just say, no, fuck you, I don't want that. Just give me the free stuff. But I will make you an offer and I'm gonna give you all of this stuff that you see right here. I didn't make this picture, I had a designer make this picture. Um, <coughs> yeah, for sure, I, I would love to do that as well, Joel. So I'm just actually, I, I kind of put a stop on interviewing people. That's one of the things I teach you guys in my free training is how to find somebody like Joel who's an influencer and how to interview them and leverage that to make money on your own and leverage that to actually build an audience and build credibility. So something that you guys should all be doing is out there finding people and just interviewing them and just giving them a, uh, a way to actually talk about what it is that they're into, what it is that they do, and there's a big reason that you guys should do that. And the reason is it can make you money. It can help you build your audience right after you. And I teach you all, I teach you exactly why in my free training. Afterwards, if you wanna take this up, it's $17 a month. I literally, uh, I literally take this money from this program and literally what I do with it, it goes to orphan kids just like this. I use it to help support orphanages and this is part of what actually funds the tier five helping hands outreach program. So you guys see us going live and you know, you guys see us going live in places like I'll, I'll show you one of them. Um, I don't post them all the time on, on Facebook because sometimes, oh look, a monkey. Cause sometimes people just, you know, fucking, poke at me and make fun of me and I get upset and then I, I start cussing them out and shit on Facebook and say that, you know, I'm just exploiting people and shit like that. Um, sometimes I do go live and actually show what we're doing in the Helping Hands program. It doesn't, at the end of the day, it doesn't matter if you guys see what we do in the Helping Hands program or if you don't see what we do in the Helping Hands program. What matters is the impact that, that the people that we support, the impact that we have on their lives. They see it. They get to see us come. They get to see what we're actually doing for us. They, for them, they get to actually see the benefit and where that comes from. I'm trying to actually find one of these posts. Like I said, I don't, I don't live stream them all the time. Um, that's not it. I don't live stream them all the time, but sometimes I post them. If you follow um, our Goodwill officer, so we have somebody. Her name is Chris Evers. Um, you'll find her on my friends list. She's the Goodwill officer at Tier Five. She's actually in charge of our Helping Hands program. Um, so she usually does a lot of live streaming and and showing like the events and 
the outreach programs and what we're actually doing in the outreach programs. But here's one of them. So this is literally, we're building a school for these kids. You can look literally, we're inside their school right now, as you can see. Um, I'm not going to turn the audio on. I'm not going to turn the audio on because I don't actually want to turn the audio on. I wish Facebook would actually open it up, turn the audio off. But this you can literally see. This is this is the kids' school, all right? This is literally like, look what you're looking at. This is these kids' schools, all right? This is literally these kids' fucking schools. So if you could just imagine, like, look around in the ambience. It's a fucking tin shack. This is a fucking tin shack that they're in. And this is they don't have a desk in here. These fucking kids sleep. I mean, they don't sleep in here because it's, it's their school. Like I said, this is where they go to school. But they sit on the fucking floor. They literally, I mean, you see you fucking, look, there's a piece of bamboo. This is what's holding the ceiling up. This is literally what's holding the ceiling up is a fucking piece of bamboo, all right? Like a fucking piece of bamboo. You got a fucking, like, little just it's a little tin shack that i i don't know if you can see it in this video or not um but maybe you can the roof isn't even fully covered like the roof isn't even fully color covered it's not insulated so we're building them an actual school a proper school like a brick building school and um, it's a ten thousand dollar project that we're doing which isn't a lot of money considering that they get a school out of the deal all right and how i fund this literally how i fund this program it's through the $17 a month offer. That's where I get the money. This money, like this entire money from this, it goes to fund the Helping Hands program at Tier 5. We don't just help those people. Those those kids are in Sunderbond. We've got another school here in Kolkata that we help. We've got an orphanage in Kolkata that we help. And then we do a lot of outreach with homeless as well. So, I mean, what do you get for the $17? You get extended training. So you get access to my private group. I do let you on my friends list. And whenever I delete everybody, um, I let you come back on my friends list. You get my mini chat chatbot training. You get my chat fuel chatbot training. That software I just sold, showed you that I normally sell, literally. Um, look, I normally sell that software right here for $47 a month. And this is not that one. This is not one of those, this is not one of those marketing tactics. All right. Uh, so I literally sell that software right here for $47 a month. Again, it's not a marketing tactic where I just like, I'm like, oh, I sell this over here um, for this much money, but you can get it over here for cheap and it's fake. That's not true at all because I'm not a marketer. Like I literally, I literally, I'll show you, I literally sell it for, <laughs> I literally sell it for that amount of money and people actually buy it. Let's see, here's somebody just today, they bought it just today. Uh, here's somebody that bought it yesterday. Here's somebody that bought it the day before. Here's somebody that bought it the day before, you know, every single day. Don't steal my fucking emails. Every single day, people literally go pay full price for just that one software. Literally, they go pay full price for just that one software. They go pay $47 a month just for that one software. I don't know why. Either I don't know why, um, but they do, other than they don't know about the, the, the offer. That software is included. Um, you get Link Wizard. I showed you Link Wizard before. Link Wizard's great. Um, I use Link Wizard every single day myself as well in my profile funnel. If you actually check out my profile funnel, you'll see a link in my profile funnel. All the links that I post are tracked with Link Wizard. Like this link right here is actually tracked with Link Wizard. Um, so I can see how many people are clicking my stuff. I can see how many people are clicking my stuff every single day. I can see, hey, are things actually working? Are things not actually working? Uh, it allows me to go in and actually see all that information, all right? So I can actually go in here and look and see what see what's actually happening inside here. Right now, my JavaScript is is fucking this up. I can see this link today got um, it's got today fifty clicks today, and it's got a three point nine percent lead conversion, which isn't great. Um, but I've got eleven leads from that link, so I can see this one. This one has a 6.94 lead conversion. I can literally track all this. And that's what Link Wizard's doing. It's doing so much other stuff as well. Link Wizard's included, um, group converts in included. This is a cool software that helps you monetize your Facebook groups. And um, you get a pro account on Magic Zap, which if you have sales funnels or websites, Magic Zap can help you customize them and make them dynamic. More importantly, it can trigger automations when people do specific things on your website, which is great, which means when somebody's looking at my pricing page for my coaching program, I can literally just trigger a phone call and get them on the phone right, right while they're literally on my pricing page. 
and I can literally just be like, Hey, what's up, Luke? You know, I know you were interested in my coaching program. I was, I was just thinking about you and how good of a fit it would be for you. And then Luke would be like, are you kidding me, John? I'm literally just on your pricing page right now. Just looking it over. I was thinking about joining, joining and then I can finish up my sales process and close them on the phone. Magic Zap allows me to do that. Uh, you get a Chirply starter account. I already showed you Chirply. We charge $97 a month for the software. So you get a starter account on that software. I'm invoicing you basic account. This will, you know, literally, um, I use invoicing you pretty much every day as well to do stuff like this, like send you guys out invoices for you guys to pay just like this. Um, whenever I don't feel like making a funnel like this post that I have on Facebook, where I'm just selling all this stuff to people for $25 right here. These people are not going to go to a funnel. I'm just literally going to send them a link just like the one I just showed you. And they're just going to go in and buy it right from there. And that's it. Um, and that's included invoice in you and genius pages is included as well. This is genius pages right here. And um, this is literally inside the builder. This is like actually this page right here. So this is genius pages right here. And um, this right now is priced at $97 a month. You're getting that account. This is like inside the builder right here. It's literally that same page that I just showed you. It's the actual website and funnel builder. So you get that software as well. And yes, you do get all of this just for $17 a month. Here's the shit other people say about me and my software and all that good stuff. Um, if you want some, some of my time for me to actually go in and help you get everything set up and make sure that you're on the right track to, you know, to accomplish whatever the fuck it is that you're trying to accomplish, you can buy that from me. If you do click this, um, I mean, hopefully you're one of the people that actually read stuff and you can understand that you're actually going to get charged, you know, just what it says here, uh, 197 one time fee and $17 a month. If you don't want that, just don't take that. All right. So you can get all that stuff right there after you take my free training and you can start using Frink Connector right away. You can literally start using all this software. What I've tried to do is I've tried to literally everything I teach you in my, in my free course, there's ways that you can make your life easier, right? Like you need a fucking chat bot. Maybe you don't know how to make a chat bot. Uh, but you need one for sure. Well, I just teach you how to make one. All right. Uh, for sure. You, you need friend connector to help you add friends for sure. You want link wizard to actually help you measure your traffic and, and see what's actually working. If something is actually working for you, you want a Facebook group because it's a good place to funnel people in. And whenever you have a Facebook group, group convert will actually help you automate that process. Uh, you want to be able to call people and text them drop them voicemails. Uh, this will help boost your conversion rate. So you're going to need that. You're going to need an invoicing you account if you want to sell stuff without going through and making funnels. If you do want to make websites and funnels, you're going to need something like Genius Pages, all right? So I've given you literally all the training, all the software that you need for $17 a month, all right? And I've made this pretty fucking picture for you. Oh my, all right? Uh, and if you don't want this again, if you don't want this, just fucking click right there. Fuck it. Click right there and just go in and take the fucking free training. I don't give a fuck. That's it though. I just wanted to show you guys and make sure that you understand that you can be, or you could do like the cool people do and you could just only get friend connector instead of all the other stuff that I mentioned. You could just only get friend connector and you can come pay $47 a month. You can pay me $30 a month extra. And you'll just only get friend connector and you won't get any of the other stuff. And people do that all day, every day. Literally, you would be surprised. You would be surprised, literally, the amount of fucking people that get to this page. And once they get to this page right here and they see that they can get all this for $17 a month. And then they're reading about friend connector that they just click right here and they go to friend connector and they end up just paying me fucking $30 an extra only for friend connector and they don't get any of the other goodies and if you guys are one of the people that did that i fucking love you people you guys are fucking great man so that's it that's all i wanted to show you today i'm gonna be getting on a plane pretty soon and going away traveling back to the u.s um if you guys would like me to come visit you while i'm in the u.s then just let me know and it's possible that i could actually come visit you while i'm in the u.s other than that you guys just have a you guys have a great day and try to stay positive, all right?